day, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. We are March 31st, 2020. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. Welcome to the Daily Dew. God bless you all for joining me. Grateful. Grateful. Truly grateful for another day and thankful for all of you. Starting out here looking at the sun. 304 angstroms. Active sunspot region coming in. It's the only activity that we're really talking about or looking at right now, but it is putting on quite a show here. Plasma filaments erecting before and now looking at loops and no coronal holes to talk about. We had the small coronal hole wind stream come in, whapped us a couple times, increased to 500 kilometers per second. still a very quiet sun. Interesting to note these plasma filaments though as this sunspot is coming in on all quadrants of the sun. Looking here to our 11 angstroms to see our heliosphere being affected. Amazing images. I love being able to look at our sun this way. The only way we can safely look at the sun. Still, only one sunspot to talk about. And this is it here, looking at the magnetic field structure of the negative and positive polarities. The green and the yellow coming in there. And we'll have a look at our magnetosphere. So this is a regular 450 kilometers per second that's going and then you can see those couple whaps there nothing major but we did get hit by an increased wind stream to about 600 kilometers per second actually having a look here at our Lasco 2 watching for any space weather effects heading our way not much to talk about Let's get to earthquakes here last 24 hours as it's been pretty quiet. It's kind of a bit concerning. Makes you wonder what's next. Uh, looking at some minor earthquakes through California and as well this Yellowstone 2.9 Montana. Montana. <laughs> uh, I never rehearsed this stuff, you know, so that's just staying in there. Okay, so Yellowstone, Montana with 2.9. Very interesting earthquake there. 5.3, largest in the last 24 hours, striking Japan. And that was the Warren region from yesterday. 5.1 as well here in the mid-Indian Ridge, 10 kilometer depth. 4.9 here in Afghanistan. South America, those were yesterday's earthquakes. And this is as well in Ecuador, 5.2. So it's been quiet today. And as well, look at this 4.6 straight the North Pole, Nerd, and Greenland. Nord, sorry. <laughs> Nord, Greenland. And you can see here, that's the only earthquake in that area the last seven days. Pretty rare earthquake. Looking at a quiet African plate, deep movement South America plate, shallow movement across North America plate. And West Ring of Fire, a lot of deep movement as well. That was the last seven days for earthquakes. Let's get to the disasters here. Most recent disasters being reported are tornado alerts across southeastern yeah, I mean, United States right now, Alabama, and we'll be moving eastward into South Carolina, North Carolina, and Georgia throughout the day. So stay aware and prepared, my friends and family. In the United States today, as there are tornado alerts popping off by the minute. Right now, Birmingham, Alabama, and as well, Mobile, Alabama. Moving into Georgia. 
still looking at many f flood alerts as well. The tornado there alerted to Tallahassee, Florida. Looking at the most recent volcanoes, Popo, <laughs> go figure, three hours ago. Dekono in Indonesia, Asosan in Japan, Sangue in Ecuador. Nevado de, Nevados de Chilean in Colombia. Stay aware and prepared, my friends. Have a plan and be ready because we may be on the verge of a three-day blackout. I'm getting a couple leaked emails, uh, messages, and there's a lot of people talking about it. We could be on the verge of a media blackout coming soon, and possibly tomorrow. So stay aware and prepared. Cross northwestern United States as winter storm moves in there. Cross South America. Watch for th thunderstorms to build again throughout Brazil and into Peru. Looking at winter storm conditions in northern Spain as that low moves eastward to the Mediterranean and still watching some extreme weather in northern India and very dry conditions across Thailand. A lot of moisture moving into South China in the five-day forecast, which we're going to get to right now. Brought to you by Meteor Earth and Meteor Mike. Looking here, a home base. Very chilly over the next few days. Temps dipping down to minus 16, the coldest. Well, maybe minus 17. But that deep low is going to get caught in that very strong high-pressure ridge north of us. And watch as the extreme weather moves southeast and into the Atlantic. And then forms a pretty sizable Atlantic low moving eastward into Europe. Five-day forecast over eastern Europe. Watch for that low to quickly scoot in and bring a lot of heavy snow, strong winds. There's about three winter storms wrapped up in there. Stay aware, prepared Finland. As well, United Kingdom, you're going to have some rain in the long-range forecast moving in. Cool temperatures hanging around. You can see here, five-day forecast, a lot of rain moving into South China, moving into Japan. Possible cyclone development here over New Caledonia, forming over Papua New Guinea and moving southeast into New Caledonia. Long-range forecast. Cooler temperature is going to be moving into southeast Australia as that low from the Antarctic heads across Tasmania. And look at these temperatures dropping down to minus one degree, about 1,000 kilometers south of Sydney. So watch for cool rains and some cool nights across the southeast Australia. Africa, not much to talk about except for daily evaporation rains, heavier amounts through the Congo region. South America, watch as this vigorous low develops. It's going to bring quite an event to South America, so stay aware and prepare my South American friends. That's a deep and strong low pressure system. And same with this one here, off the coast of Antarctica. Thanks for watching today. I'm going to leave you here looking at the Southern Hemisphere versus the Northern. Much love to you all. Stay aware and prepared and watch for a possible Gulf storm forming in the, in the long range forecast. Thanks for watching again. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Bye bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world. Thank you.
Thank you.